Good morning. Philippians 3, verse 20. But our citizenship, but is that contrast with what was said in verses 18 and 19, right? Where we discussed enemies of the cross who were Judaizers, who were serving external earthly realities as a means of righteousness. At contrast with that, we are not serving in that same way, but our citizenship, Philippians 3.20, is in heaven. And from it, we await a savior, the Lord Jesus Christ. So from it, meaning he's going to come from heaven. He will be identified from heaven. Uh, in that way, he is bringing heaven to earth. We will ultimately live on a new earth, fully transformed. Our citizenship right now, your citizenship, is not primarily a citizen of America. Your citizenship is not in the state in which you reside. Your citizenship is not within the city or polis within which you reside. The word for citizenship there is polituma, polituma. I think po po political, we get, right? Politics comes from that. Polis comes from that, the city. So it has to do with uh, governance. What does it mean that our citizenship is in heaven? It means first that our primary locus of identity is not here. It doesn't mean that we don't really live in a place and that we don't become part of that place. It means that the source of our primary identity isn't around us here. It's outside of here. It's heaven. We're identified by that country, so to speak. We're identified. That's why we're an alien, ultimately, and a stranger, as as Peter will say in 1 Peter multiple times. Um, in that way, we get our identity sourced from there, which means, secondly, that if we're a citizen of heaven, even and our identity is primarily sourced from there, it means that we serve, then, heaven. So our interests are not in service of what's around us here. Our interests are in service of a different place and a different reality. Our marching orders aren't coming from our local context. Our marching orders are coming from a different context. So remember, you might be invited by people even in a religiously saturated culture to be governed by the service of those things around you, the external things. It might be inviting for you culturally to become an elitist, to try it, or, or to have prowess, or to have money, or to get to to somehow uh, engage even in um, uh, sexual indulgence, e eroticism. And you might find it through power, money, sex is the kind of things that feed your soul. Don't buy into it. Your citizenship is not here. Your citizenship is in heaven, which means your identity is sourced there, and you your service is directed there. So literally serve heaven on earth. Serve heaven on earth today if you're a citizen of heaven. Take care.